He collars and leads off. About to be called in. In they go, first line away, second line goes forward, they're all in, green line signal, Bunny travels here for race seven. Favourite in the yellow, hyperactive, all set. Ready and racing, clear last out with Surf in vain. Nice your way, Andy's charm went to the early lead from Dale's Jet and Fred the Weapon. Oh, followed back on the inside was Wanted Moore. Over on the inside then was Surf in vain. Hyperactive as wide, six off the lead with still a bit of work to do. And I, Diana Nitro's back at the tail. Dale's Jet's going to turn in front now of Andy's charm out. Very deep, Fred the Weapon. Hyperactive got pushed right out of it, but the leader wanted more. Dale's Jet comes back the outside. Dale's Jet come back and beat Wanted Moore. Closing third, Surf in vain, nearly a dead heat. Fourth, Fred the Weapon, Hyperactive can go either way. Jody Lee Cave was next in, oh, followed by Iona Nitro, and it was one of the last home. Time recorded of 26 and 70. Number one, the winner, Dale's Jet. One red, Dale's Jet. Four blue, wanted Moore's run second, got through, grabbed the lead halfway up, but Dale's Jet's come back. And number seven has run third, Surf in vain, with two, Fred the Weapon, fourth, one, four, seven and two, 26 and 70, the overall time. The winner, Dale's Jet, by Lockenvale Marlow at a Shampner's Gal. It is raced by Daniel Zara, trained by Stuart Hazlitt. Second goes to number four, one at more, Wayne Borlin, and seven, Surf in Vain, third, Michael Clayton, one, four, seven, two, a half length by one with the margins, a half by one. The splits there of 10, 12, and 1983. They've come home there in 687, 2670 was the uh, overall time. The favourite there, Hypoactive, uh, come out moderately.